How to Make Chicory Coffee Chicory root is a caffeine-free substance that tastes similar to coffee when brewed. It is used as both a coffee additive and a coffee substitute. Chicory coffee is a cultural tradition that originated in France and spread to the Louisiana colonies, including New Orleans. Method 1 Preparing the Chicory 1. Get some chicory root. You can buy the root whole from a local grocery store or spice market, or you can also dig up the plant in the wild. Chicory is a beautiful purple flower that grows in empty lots and beside the road in North America. You can also purchase ground chicory root that has already been mixed with coffee grounds. Chicory coffee is a New Orleans specialty, so you may need to order online if you aren't in the area. 2. Find chicory in the wild. Learn how to identify it so that you don't dig up the wrong plant. Chicory is a perennial herbaceous plant that grows in gravel or weedy fields, often beside roadways, across most of Canada and the U.S. The flowers are light blue or lavender and slightly ruffled at the ends of their petals. Dig up the plant carefully to preserve the roots. To prepare for coffee, wash the roots until all the dirt is off. Dry the whole root on a towel in the sun. The chicory plant flowers from July to October. The flowers only open on sunny days. The roots, however, are best to pick between fall and spring. The leaves and root of the plant are the bits that most people eat. The flower itself is technically edible, but it has a bitter taste. 3. Mince the roots with a sharp knife. The bits should be no longer than one inch each. Make sure that they are small enough that they will roast quickly, but not so small that they will burn through. You don't need to worry about peeling the root. 4. Toast the chicory root. Arrange the root pieces on a baking sheet, then cook at 350 degrees until golden brown. You should smell a rich, coffee-like aroma. Remove the baking sheet from the oven and let the chicory cool. Method 2 Mixing Chicory with Coffee 1. Grind the chicory root. Use a coffee grinder to reduce the root to a fine powder. If you intend to mix the chicory root with coffee grounds, then you should try to grind your chicory to about the same coarseness as your coffee. If you don't have a coffee grinder, try mincing the root very finely. Try using a mortar and pestle to crush the toasted root. 2. Mix ground chicory with ground coffee. The ratio is completely up to you. Coffee is caffeinated, and chicory is not. Chicory is usually somewhat more acidic than coffee, although some prefer the taste. Experiment with various ratios of chicory to coffee until you find a combination that suits you. Perhaps you only want to cut your coffee for the taste of the chicory. You may want to stretch your coffee supply so that it lasts a bit longer. Try a 1 to 4 or 1 to 5 ratio of chicory to coffee. If you are trying to seriously reduce your coffee consumption, try a 1 to 2 or a 2 to 3 ratio of chicory to coffee. Consider drinking a mostly chicory blend. Perhaps you want the warmth and the taste of coffee but not the stimulating effects. Try a 4 colon 1 or 5 colon 1 blend of chicory to coffee. 3. Brew Chicory Coffee Make coffee as you normally would, using a French press, a coffee machine, a pour, over, or a pot of boiling water. Use the mixed chicory and coffee grounds in place of straight coffee grounds. The brew time and the other logistics should be the same as making regular coffee. Consider using chicory as a way to wean yourself off of coffee. Over the course of several weeks, gradually increase the ratio of chicory to coffee until you are drinking mostly non-caffeinated chicory. Method 3 Using Chicory as a Coffee Substitute 1. Boil Chicory Coffee Bring 1 cup of water to a boil, then add 2 tablespoons of the minced and toasted chicory root. Cover and let simmer for 10-15 minutes. Double or triple the recipe depending on the volume that you want. 2. Alternately, grind the chicory root and brew the powder. Brew chicory coffee however you usually brew coffee. Use a French press, a coffee machine, a pour, over, or any other method of your choosing. You may also boil and simmer the powder as you would with the minced root. 3. Drink chicory coffee. Strain the brew into a cup and enjoy. Chicory is caffeine-free, which is part of why so many people favor it as a coffee substitute. Chicory is also touted for a bevy of health benefits, including digestive and immunity support, 
high antioxidant levels, reduced inflammation, and a lowered heart rate. Try adding honey and milk, or molasses, or a sweetener of your choice. Chicory can be somewhat more acidic than regular coffee, so it may taste better if you cut it.